Hey guys, thanks for clicking on this video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to recover your Sony Vegas Pro project from a random crash. Now if you just forgot to save it and close it down, I don't think it'll work, but I mean you can try it. What do you got to lose, right? To do this though, you're going to have to have the hidden folders option enabled. To do that, you click start, control panel, and look for the one that says folder options. Mine happens to be right here on the right side, so I click that, and this thing will pop out. Once this pops out, click the view tab, and once this pops out, look scroll down actually or not even scroll down just look right here where it says don't show hidden files folders and drives you're going to want to click the one that says show hidden files folders and drives and then click apply so once you got that you're ready to go all right so to do what we set off to do is click start computer and click your hard drive wherever you installed sony vegas so click that and then click users once you click users click your your folder whichever one you are um, there's like a bunch of profiles but this is the one I'm using right now so I click Jasmine and click the one that says app data so I click app data and then the one that says local you want to click that once this you want to click that you may see this you may not depends what you have in here uh, but yeah just scroll down until you find the one that says Sony mine happens to be right here at the very bottom I click that and then click the one that says Vegas Pro and Depending on which version you have, it'll have a different number. So I only, I only have Sony Vegas Pro 12, so that's why it's 12 is right there. But if you have Sony Vegas Pro 10 or 11 or something, it will have that number. So click that, and here are all your auto saves. I don't know how many, like, what the time sequences. Like, I don't know how many times it auto saves and when it auto saves. I just know it auto saves. So, yeah. Um, yours, the one you're looking for is the most recent one, so... Yeah, click the first one. Mine happens to be right there. I open that up, and there you go. Now, I erased all the, the files from here because this is an old project. So I'm going to have to click ignore all missing files and leave them offline. Click OK. But all the text thing happens to be here. Um, yeah, this is from an old video. But yeah, guys, that's about it. So thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.